Hello YouTube, this, welcome back to the Yellow Pages Scam Channel. This video is going to be a personal fuck you to Yellow Pages. Because Yellow Pages has no right to put people through this, to put me through this. Like, do you know what it's like to have someone say, like, you owe a debt and you have to, you're responsible for it. And Chen, you'll hear those, along those lines, from the debt collector. And like, when, when they said that to me, it's like, I don't owe any debt. Yellow Pages is gonna burn. Now, after this, I sort of believe in God more after this. Let me explain. Because I believe God was on my side over this whole thing. Because there are so many little fuck ups that Yellow Pages made that I am about 99% sure if I went to court I would cream Yellow Pages. I'm sure there are many situations where if, if they just let it go in your case and stop calling debt collectors on you and just left you alone, you would just let it go because they are sort of doing you a favor because they don't have much on you and you don't have much on them. But in my case, I have so so much against them that yeah I probably could destroy them in court so yeah fuck you y'all pages stop treating pe people like this stop treating customers like this like for I've, I've always promoted the Consumer Affairs website on this YouTube channel and like it's just like bad review after bad review after bad review. It's not like five bad, one good, four bad, one good. It's like bad, bad, bad. Overall rating, one star. Like, and consumeraffairs.com is like a, a real, really high, re, high respected site. And they try to work with these companies to get them to improve them, like improve their company. Oh, it's a really serious website and I haven't signed up because in order to sign up and write a review, you have to give all your information. And I mean all, not just your email, like your, your home address, where you live, all that shit. It's, it's like, wow, they're not fucking around. <laughs> and... So, I believe on the website it says uncredible. And I'm not sure of this, but I heard, I think that means that Yelp Pages doesn't work with consumer affairs, so they really don't care about these reviews. But even still, 
368 reviews and I'm talking about like reviews these are like page to a paragraph long of just horror story after horror story not just like one line bad good I had a bad experience no like full page reviews so click the annotation to check that website out yeah I just made this video to say fuck you yellow pages and if you ever see me in court I hope you have the best lawyer ever but that's a pretty gutsy thing to say for me, but you're gonna need the best lawyer ever to argue the evidence and facts I have. Like, you're gonna have to argue that I didn't cancel and you didn't accept, so in essence, you're gonna have to make emails disappear like they didn't even exist. Well, that's very hard to do. So, yeah, good luck with that. And <sighs> while we're on the topic, there's, I've gone over in my head there's only one way for you to ever win in court and that is if you manipulated the verbal contract to say what you wanted it to say and you would have to edit out the part where I said can I cancel and she said yes you would have to edit that out to win. Now you're tampering with evidence. You know, I'm going to be honest here. I don't know how I would ever prove that, but I would know it. Therefore, I would not rest until I proved it. Yeah. Fuck you, yellow pages. If you would like to learn more about the Yellow Pages scam and debt collection, please check out the videos on my channel. I hope you all have a great day. Thank you.